Hello and welcome. My name's Natasha, aka Ali2GoldenHawk. Today's video will be quite quick and I'll be showing you a new way to get into the Ravenclaw common room. If you want to get into the other common rooms, please check out my YouTube page as I'll be releasing videos on how to glitch into all of the houses. This way is much more simple and a lot easier to replicate. Unlike the other videos, we'll be skipping how to get out of bounds. If you're not sure how to do that, I'll leave a link in the description below of another video I created yesterday showing some much easier ways how to get out of bounds within the Hogwarts grounds. But let's jump right into the glitch. Once you get to Hogwarts, you want to make sure that you are located right at the bottom of the Ravenclaw Tower. You can do that by opening your map and making sure you're under the same tower as I am. Once you're sure you're at the right one, you can start to fly up. It's a pretty big tower, so it does take a little while. But once you're at the top, you'll know you're there by spotting the balcony area right at the top. If you fly into the exact location I'm in, you'll notice that there is an invisible block which doesn't allow you to fly through it. You'll want to find this invisible block and try to find the top so you can land right on top of it. I'll upload very slow motion frames of the exact location my character's in so you can get a better view. With this glitch, it'll push you right into the Ravenclaw common room area without any chance that you might get stuck in the girls' dormitory. And that's all there is to it. Now you're in the Ravenclaw common room. I hope you enjoy exploring and getting to know the Ravenclaw common room as much as I have. Please make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel at Ellie2GoldenHawk and check out my videos for more Hogwarts Legacy updates. Thanks for watching.